Imagine this. You wake up and get out of bed. Take your books and emeralds and go to the librarian to get your last book for your god sword. You're very happy that you finally did it and you combined the books and in an anvil to get the ultimate book. You quickly rush back to your house and get your netherite sword out of your hidden storage and you take it to another anvil you put the book and the sword in the anvil and you suddenly see too expensive. Burn yourself in a campfire and you never enter the world again. Here's how to prevent this problem. Okay, so guys, now you know uh, how sad it is to not be able to acquire all the enchantments that you want on your favorite sword. You lose a lot of XP levels and you have a book which is overpowered but you can't use it at all because you can't put it on to the sword in the anvil. So guys... I, bef uh, before I started combining those books, I had a hundred levels. Now I have 18. That just goes to show you how much XP you waste with this um, standard way of uh, combining books with items. So now I'm going to quickly pop into creative mode, get all the enchantments that i had give me a second okay so now i'm gonna g quickly explain to you why this works and the other strategy doesn't so i'm gonna need to go a bit in the technical side of minecraft but i promise i'll try and do it in a pretty quite simple way so minecraft items have a hidden property called anvil units so Every f e one of these books has zero anvil uses. But if I combine these two like so, this one will have one anvil use. So you're gonna take your books into pairs. So I've got my pairs here like so. Leave this extra one here. So um, what you want to do is take one of your pairs, combine them in the cheaper way. And so basically, uh, one more important part, this book in this side is being put on this book on this side. Just a quick information for you. So we put a zero and, um, anvil use book on another zero anvil use book. We have a one anvil use book. We do that again, again in the cheaper orientation. You gotta check that. One anvil use, one anvil use. And the last pair here, we take this. So now we have a one anvil use book, one anvil use book, a one anvil use book, and a zero anvil use book. So we're gonna take our two anvil use book and combine it with our zero anvil use book in the cheaper orientation, like so. Now we have a two anvil use book. Now we take these one anvil use books. Here we've got another two anvil use book. 
now we combine these two in the cheaper orientation and we take our netherite sword here and we get this like so and so guys because of the anvil uses to get sharpness 3 from 2 sharpness 2 books like so in the cheaper orientation costs me 3 levels but if going from sharpness 1 books so I combine them into sharpness 2 books and then to sharpness 3 books costs me 5 levels so that doesn't seem like much for now but if you would like to try uh, going to sharpness 5 or something then you might see the difference oh and uh, it cost five levels to combine the sharpness two uh, books together from the sharpness one book and that's xp not counting the cost of connecting the sharpness one books into the sharpness two books if that makes sense oh and guys one more very important trick is the normal player would do this so they would connect combine their swords and then they would want to rename the sword and that can be quite expensive so that's 16 extra levels and here when we rename the netherite sword before we combine it it costs us one level and this costs us 35 exactly the same so that's 15 levels that you just saved so guys i really do hope that you enjoyed this video it was a ton of fun to make and i hope these uh, simple tips and tricks will help you save a lot of xp and maybe even save you from wasting lots of time gathering up a book with op enchantments just to check see that you can't put it on your favorite sword so guys i will see you in the next one bye bye do you like my moose hut? I built it the other day on one of my multiplayer servers and I mirrored it here because I think it looks really quite nice. Bye bye.